Rev up your engines. Well, I may not know who you are personally, but I know your type. You're the fellow that'll hop on forums and other resources on the internet to figure out how to fix things without actually taking anything apart yourself. Well, lucky for you, you got a guy like me to show you how to get it done. And today we'll be fixing this rear leaf spring. It's off the Bronco, but it applies to anything that has one of these suckers on the back. Now you may be thinking to yourself, well, Andy, you can't fix that because it's cracked. Well, that's where you're wrong. <laughs> See, with a little bit of know-how and a few ports from around the shop, you'll have this thing back installed in your vehicle and headed down the road in no time. Let me show you how. <laughs> now, I told you this was going to be easy. Use Gorilla Glue. Now, this is some of the greatest stuff you can use on any part. Some say you could even use it for hair. So go ahead and apply that to your crack there. Little dabble, do ya? And that's going to bond together and hold this spring so tight, you'll swear you paid top dollar for some of those high-end springs. Now, if you're like me and you don't like waiting, go ahead and cover it with some of this rust reformer. It's going to hide all the ugly blemishes. And if you have some of this laying around, go ahead and use some undercoating as well, because that's going to cover all of the bumps and cracks and make everything somewhat smooth again. Let's check this out. Now let me ask you a question. Who's gonna know? That's gonna be great. And there she is, all freshly installed. Doesn't it look great? I told you Gorilla Glue can solve the problem. And if it doesn't work in your case, I'd rather not be sued. But be sure to like and subscribe. Enjoy the day.